Next up, fractionalizing real estate assets and really maximizing the benefits of commercial real estate investing. A huge pool to get into and on a global scale. So let's take a look at what is in store. And joining us to host the conversation is Acru, keynote presentation by Acru founder and CEO, Moshe Masood. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks so much for having a crew present at the LA Blockchain Summit. Uh, we really appreciate uh, Crypto and Home having us here. My name is Mosin Nasir, and I'm the founder and CEO for a crew. A crew was launched last year at, right after the LA Blockchain Summit. I was at a panel where I was talking about how we we're about to launch the company, and it was under a different brand name. Since then, we've gone long ways and we've developed a product where we've got great traction. We've got lots and lots of investors and assets on the platform and people taking full benefit of how the platform works. I'm gonna walk you through where we've been, what our journey's been and, and how we're affecting commercial real estate and what, what really Accru is doing. So Accru, uh, our mission is to democratize commercial real estate investing. What I've told you about so far about myself is I'm just a founder and CEO. But one thing that I have not told you is my background is purely real estate. It's not technology. I am not a tech expert who's, who's come together to build this platform or, or who's, put, who's putting all the energy in this. I've lived and breathed real estate all of my life. I grew up in a real estate family in Islamabad, Pakistan. Went, uh, went to York University for my undergrad, managed our family's real estate investments globally. We had investments in Asia, Africa, Europe, Middle East, and I expanded that into the US set up my own shop, syndicated deals, and had over, uh, close to $100 million of assets under management before I had an aha moment where someone was explaining to me what blockchain really is. At this point, it is very key, the differentiation that we created between blockchain and cryptocurrencies. That's a big, big, big aspect. All blockchain is not equal to cryptocurrency. Crypto is a subset of blockchain, is our core belief. And we really believe in using blockchain as the underlying technology, what everyone's been talking about today, what people were talking about on, on the previous panel, what Doug talked about at the end, with every every uh, digital asset being self custody because of how smart contracts are built and how smart smart contracts are done. Just like INX has developed using the 14, ERC 1404 standard, that's how a crew went ahead and developed a multi-token architecture. What we did is we created security tokens representing investment within a single direct asset. We created utility tokens representing funds, your funds sitting in a bank account, a licensed bank account, which is secure at, and at your disposal. We created an identity token that helps us ensure compliance. We know we can ensure for the regulators, the full KYC, the accreditation verification, AML on, and transaction monitoring, the whole nine yards. And we created a governance token. Now, this is not your traditional crypto governance token. This is very focused towards the governance of each specific asset. Real estate requires decision making by all members at, on the asset level. And that's what our governance token is there for. It lets us decide who's, who's allowed to vote on which matter, up to what extent, based on their holdings and based on their level of investment. So what did Accru develop? Accru created a platform for fractional real, is real estate investing with investments as low as $1,000 per token. Unheard of before. Now there's others that offer lower uh, minimums, but they don't offer the flexibility and the liquidity that we enable. We created a secondary marketplace, which is all fully integrated, all into one single dashboard. And that is how we're democratizing commercial real estate. Next. It, I'll show you what kind of attention we've gotten so far. And we've grown quite a bit since we launched. So we formally launched as a crew at the Security Token Summit earlier this year, March 25th. Since then, we've had over $750,000 worth of tokens transacted on the platform. Over 150 active accredited investors on the platform. We've got more than 1,500 non-accredited investors on our wait list. As soon as we open up the platform to retail investors, we we have a massive list of people ready to join in and move forward. We've got 14 assets that are confirmed for, for the platform. Three of them already listed, fully funded, or raising money for right now. 
There's 11 more coming real soon, all either demonstrating you know, opportunity zone assets or direct investments, stable cash flows, giving you quarterly uh, distributions in, uh, in the form of rental income and all the stability and growth that you need. Most importantly, we've got funds sitting on the platform with investors waiting to invest as every deal comes on board. And while we've done all of that, it hasn't gone unnoticed. Every big media outlet out there has noticed what we've been doing within the industry. And we really appreciate all of that. This is how a crew functions. We use technology to cut out the middleman, management layers, and portfolio downside risk to provide lucrative and secure direct investments. Accrue. Not sure if you guys caught the audio on that. We might have faced some kind of technical issues on that front. Uh, but let's uh, hopefully we'll, we'll catch the audio in the future ones. What are the key benefits of tokenizing assets? There's two sides to this marketplace. There's the investors and there's the asset owners. You have the institutional investors and the individual investors. You have the institution asset owners and the individual asset owners. Single biggest benefit is direct investments into assets of your choice as an investor. You can maximize your returns as we eliminate all the costly intermediaries within, within uh, the transaction. Liquidity at your fingertips. We're truly enabling liquidity where you can list tokens as you want and people can place offers on it and you can, uh, and you can sell them as soon as there's a buyer who's willing to buy them at the price you want. That's instantaneous transaction the minute that the match happens. We've got the security of a publicly, uh, of a public blockchain. The investment threshold is down to just $1,000. Imagine that $1,000 that you have sitting in your savings account could start help you building your wealth from one security token to the next. And investing is as simple as a click. This does not happen anywhere else. With a single click, you can go ahead and you can purchase your security tokens just like you would within your capital markets, your Fidelity accounts, or your, your Robinhood account. On the asset owner side, there's a mul multitude of benefits. Some of the key uh, benefits include asset owners are able to recapture gains that they were, they're not previously able to, unless they go for that 10-year cycle on, on, on refinancing an asset or they completely sell the asset. They get to retain full control of the asset, even after fractionalizing it. And the true value of the asset gets unlocked. And you have to realize, when talking about commercial real estate and valuations of commercial real estate, the biggest factor affecting and bringing down the value of the asset is the discount on marketability of an asset. And on large scale or institutional commercial assets, that really plays a major factor. Now, what happens is when we're moving the asset from a private market to a pub, semi public market of sorts, when we're allowing for that liquidity, when we're enabling that liquidity, when we're letting you transact those, to those tokens, we're actually unlocking that true value. We're getting you closer and closer to that true value of that asset. And what we like to call is we're adding a liquidity premium on the value of, on the market value of that asset. Tokenization or fractionalization of the asset allows for a permanent capital structure. As an asset owner, you never have to worry about redemptions. You never have to worry about that capital structure moving around. Compliance and investor management are always uh, an issue. 
you know, I've gotten phone calls when I was uh, doing real estate from some of my investors. Why did you make that $100,000 upgrade to that building? My brother-in-law could have done it for $50,000. Well, not really. Uh, you know, does he, is he in the Ohio market? No. Is he a commercial uh, contractor or is he a residential contract? Uh, he's a residential contract. Well, that, there we go. It's a completely different ballgame. You never have to deal with anything like that ever again. It all happens through a single portal. And, and then reporting, year-end, documents going out, all of that is such a hassle. And those quarterly distributions or, or semi-annual distributions that, that asset owners have to do, well, it all happens with a single click, just like investing. So what kind of assets do we list on the platform? We're focused purely on core assets and some core plus assets. Uh, some of you would be wondering what that means. That means stable assets, which are income producing. We want to make sure that you get that quarterly rent check in your crew account, eh, quarter after quarter after quarter. We want to make sure that you have all the data available. And that's why that's, those are the kind of assets we go after. We do bring on some value add assets on the platform currently as well. Those assets are going to be taking uh, are, are, are a very small chunk. Now we want we, we understand that everyone wants to make money on real estate, and we know HGTV and all these flipper channels have boasted the energy in us for hey we buy it we fix it and we sell it we get a house or we get a building. But those are the riskiest deals out there, and so those are going to be the last to, to make their way on our platform. What's our expansion plan? Uh, the areas that we serve, we're currently serving the Midwest, so all uh, Midwest and, and, and part of the uh, mountain area. So all the areas that you see in the green. Up next, we're going to go in the south and the sun level. Followed by that, we'll be going, uh, uh, opening up the platform to the coast. And guess what? We don't just stop there. We intend on going global. Over the next three years, we, we intend on launching not just, uh, not just across the U.S., but also across the European Union, including the UK, LATAM, as well as Asia. We've got some great new features. You know what, a platform is only as good, or, or an app or, or anything is only as good as, uh, as the features it has and as the happy customers that they have. Not only have we already brought on board our premium accounts, allowing for investors to make larger uh, allocations, but we've also allowed for investors to create multiple entities under the same account. Whether you want to create a joint account with your kids or your wife or your partner, or you want to create a trust account, or you want to just invest through multiple different entities for whatever reason it may be, you can do all of that and make all those allocations the way you want. Now, a lot of us rely on our financial advisors and wealth managers to make investments on our behalf. We have our, our savings and our investment portfolios managed by someone else. And we listen to what you have to say. We created a wealth manager's portfolio. We allow your advisors and your wealth managers to, to create and onboard you as a customer on our platform and make investments in your port. We provide all the risk analysis tools needed for that. And guess what? Everyone wants to maximize leverage when investing in real estate. We completely understand that. We don't want you to be left out of that. That's not just something there for the top 1%. That's why we brought on some great uh, banking partners and great lenders on the platform. Uh, and we're gonna, be, uh, we're, we're gonna be launching our margin trading on, on our platform here within the next quarter. What that's gonna let you do is, you would you not, not only have to sell your token or you sell your, uh, your piece of the asset to get some kind of liquidity, you could borrow up to 50, even 60% in some cases on some of these assets. And you could really maximize your returns and, re and, and realize the gains that, that you have and, and access to liquidity. And we're only as good as the partners who we have. And we're proud to say we've got some great partners from the industry, some, some industry leaders who are providing all the data, the information, the financial uh, backgrounds, and the security of your funds. Data is something that is only as good as the integrity that, that, that's behind it. So we, we've partnered up with Inventive, which is the single truth, source of truth for all of our data. Not only do they verify the data, they also record it on chain. So you can always 
see if there's ever been a change in that data, who made it and under what circumstances. We use Duala as, as our payment partner. Uh, compliance is key, whether you're talking about KYC, know your customer, uh, anti-money laundering, laundering monitoring, accreditation verification, all of that is absolutely integral. And most importantly, managing broker dealers in, in the case of offering securities, or unregistered securities for that matter. So we partnered up with MBD Solutions for, for managing broker dealer. We partnered up with Accurate, global leader in providing KYC and AML monitoring for larger financial institutions. We partnered up with Early IQ for uh, providing accreditation verification for us. And guess what? You don't have to only invest your savings or your IRA dollars in your mutual funds and your bonds. Those are not the safest in, or, or the only safe investments out there. You can actually invest them through a self-directed IRA in real estate, no matter how big or how small an investment you want to make. It's not just something for larger uh, IRA holders. We partner up with Auto IRA to enable investors on our platform to utilize their IRA dollars and allocate a part of it in fractionalized commercial real estate. So now with that $50,000, you don't have to buy that. Just, just one, um, uh, one asset that you, you, you could allocate into. You can actually invest in 50 different assets if you really wanted to. We're lucky to have great investors, just like the producers of, of, of this summit. Draper Gordon Home has been our lead investor for a seed round, and we've got some other great investors from across the country. Milwaukee Venture Partners, Wisconsin Investment Partners, and Queen City Angels are, are, are some of our largest investors. Here's a short clip to tell you how you can get started with the crew. Complicated? A crew lets you focus on what is really important, life. Invest in premium commercial real estate for as low as $1,000 without hassle and worry. A crew, making the exclusive inclusive. So that's exactly it. We're here to make the exclusive inclusive. We want to make sure that everyone has access to this investing class, which previously did not have, uh, which previously they did not have. We want to make sure that everyone across the globe, everyone across the U.S. has equal opportunity, and everyone's able to invest in commercial real estate. Having said that, we're only open to accredited investors at this time, and we're working diligently with the regulators to open it up to retail investors. Thank you so much. And we couldn't have done this without all of our partners, our investors, and everyone here at Team Accrue. Thank you once again. My name is Mosin Nasir. I'm the founder and CEO for Accrue. If you want to get a hold of us, feel free to call us, reach me by email, or, or contact us on our website, www.accrue.co. Thank you.